afternoon, everyone. Uh, we are headed down to Chillicothe, Illinois, uh, for the Crimea River Trail Runs 100. Uh, this July 7th here. Um, yeah, so this is a 20 mile uh, quasi loop, more or less an out and back. It starts with a two mile loop around Camp Wakanda and then runs through Robinson and uh, Detweiler Parks in the Peoria area um, and then back to camp and uh, repeat five times. Uh, crazy amount of vert. It's uh, close to just a little under 5,000 per loop. Um, stairs, craziness, uh, up and down. You know, I'll, I'll take some video. Uh, it will probably be typical. I uh, get good video the first 20 miles and then uh, hang on after that and give updates on my decaying self. Uh, the race starts at noon on Friday, tomorrow. You have 36 hours, so until midnight on Saturday to complete it. Uh, I've got my crew coming down: uh, Tara, Aaron, and Eileen. Um, so looking forward to sharing miles with them. They're each going to do a loop and uh, be out there making sure that I'm not dead. Uh, they're going to come down tomorrow. Should be in right about, right about the time that I finish my first loop. So uh, hopefully around five o'clock. Shoot for a little bit slower uh, loops than what I would typically do at mines. Uh, so this is going to be about a 5 5:15 to start, uh, maybe in a 5:30. Purposely going slow for the elevation. Uh, and it's going to be around a 30-hour, uh, 100 miler for me is my goal. So if you have 36 hours, might need it all. Who knows? Uh, but we'll find out. See you when we get to camp. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Camp Wakanda. Uh, Seamar Crimea River 100 starts this morning, or at noon. So we are T minus an hour and a half. Should be fun. Weather is perfect. It's going to be mid to upper 70s instead of 90s. Chance of rain overnight tonight, uh, but then dry all day tomorrow. So. Let's get ready to have some fun. I'll show you the camp here in just a few minutes when I get all the way down there. Crimea River start line. Everyone's still getting set up. Aid station, start finish aid. Nice shower this location. Um, we have a camp cabin right there on the back. And my gear all set up. So just people start to straggle in. Um, Pretty conveniently located here, right in the center. All right, everyone, kind of get up here. Oh, Ben's gonna crush it. <laughs> we'll see. That's what everyone does. Uh, yeah. <laughs> try not to go much past oh, me, or your race will start now. One minute. Uh -huh. I already got my watch done. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> It's kind of... Rachel, there's that much competition. Oh, God. Yeah. Yep. Rachel, I was fifth overall. Yeah. yeah. You got a lot of us that you can beat. Yeah, because if you beat the second place female by two, three hours, it's kind of like... All right, everyone. Let's go. We're pretty close here, kids. Okay, Rach. I'm just waiting for it to say noon so you dummies can take off. <laughs> Let's go. Have fun, guys. Have a good race. All right, everyone, let's have fun. All right, part of the chill bill loop here. Backside, a little over a mile in, 1243 Terra was my first mile.
up a little lake here. Into camp. Woohoo! Two miles down. All right. <laughs> Two percent. <laughs> the old two percenter. Different tea bags everywhere I go. All right. Oh, puppers. And into the cabins. Well, 51, mile two. All right. Now, the cool part about this, see all the tubing, maple syrup. Pretty fun place. We got places everywhere from these maple syrup lines. Here's the old scout camp. So good first uh, chill bill loop, 25 minutes, and here we go. All right, on our way out to Robinson for the first time, and one of everyone's favorites. This set of stairs. I say this because. There's gonna be a lot more stairs along the way. But this one just seems to kick a little. It's not the worst set, but it's hard. That bench will be comfortable later. Just not right now. We're getting there. Oh, why do we sign up for this shit? Oh yeah, that's fun. Type A, type two, whatever you want to call it. Topping out. Yeah. 
and now one of the more runnable sections of the course we're heading into. Nice little shelter. Might need that in the rains later. All right, that is six miles in, 15.43 there. Nice, slowed down mile, a lot of hills, eight something. So that was a very good, smart mile there. Especially since I've been running a whole bunch of 12s to start. Uh, coming up on the highway trash people pick up your trash shout out to Bonnie Bush for teaching us to clean up the trails um, yeah should be a good time this is still North Robinson we are heading towards the infamous tunnel under the highway I can Here's the cars a little bit now. So we should be there shortly. So here we're coming up on this little overlook that sees the highway. It's only because it's first loop. Am I gonna go off course? There's our highway. We're gonna go under. I always got to look at it. Ah, the rushing sound of cars as you go by. Semi. <laughs> and tunnel talk. Only way to go underneath the highway. <laughs> And there we go. That is that side of the tunnel. All right, here we go. Heading out of Detweiler into the aid station. Boggy little thing. A lot nicer with the new bridge here. Remember last year when Aaron ran this? It bounced like a son of a gun. Oh. We're a little over 11 miles heading in. Um, two and a half hour on the clock time. So, back 231. That's what I got right now. So, that's pretty good. Pretty good start for 11 miles. Um, in fact, that's ahead of pace. But we won't tell the girls yet. Hey, Tara. Let's go see our good buddy Jim. Some dogs, sounds like. And friends.
Is that me? Flatlanders. A raccoon booth from last year. Whoop, whoop. All right. Um, um, at pot. Oh, Jesus. Here's our next fun stair climb. Oh yeah. Yeah. So fun. <laughs> Sir, you said you won this one before? Yeah. Was that in 16? Yeah. Nice. Oh, you don't? Oh, yeah. I got a feeling that Ben kid's gonna do it. He's fast. All right, here we are on the Detweiler Trail. Heading to the turnaround, 10 miles in. I'm doing pretty good for an old bastard. <laughs> Haven't seen anyone barreling back the other way yet. Not even though I know there's a group ahead of us. So, it means they only got about a mile, mile and a half ahead of me. So, that's good to see. Stop that Wilder Aid station. All right, we got Sled Hill coming out of that Wilder back to Robinson. See ya. See ya. Good luck. Walking it up. All right, here we go back to the tunnel. Uh, we are 16 miles in. Feeling all right. We've got 3,300 feet of vertical gain and climbing. Another Eagle Scout project. <sighs> the Tunnel of Terror. Just sneak my kids through this sometime. It's good Berkeley training though. <laughs> the elevation and a tunnel. All right, that's the good stuff. All right, this is Robinson Park. Site of our Salubis drinking fountain. 
just wet the whistle a little bit and clean the face off a couple miles about two miles from the start finish so I'm ahead of pace by a bit so we're gonna take this in slow and uh, yeah you have from there pretty day pretty good so far and there's just so many fun bridges out here can't take them all in I'm gonna have to look for the bouncy one next time I get it on camera because that's one of my favorites uh, just hit 20 miles just about done with the first loop feeling all right uh, see how it goes Tara and Aaron are on their way now Eileen is right behind them so the crew is coming uh, I kind of want some uh, coffee and sour gummy worms right now but that's kind of my go-to if I want junk this is the gummy worms uh, they always make me feel good sugar obviously and then coffee because I'm an addict so Just bringing her on in. Pretty day. How you ladies doing today? Doing great. How are you? Oh, good looking and modest. <laughs> Woo! And funny. Too. Yeah. Well, that's what the wife thinks. <laughs> now here we go this way. Oh, and I'm purposely going slow. It goes faster than it's supposed to be. And I'm trying to level out a little bit on my time here. Not terribly off, though. Because the distance is longer than 20 miles. So, here's one of our shallower water crossings salubrious steps accommodating I think I got one more hill before camp not too bad <sighs> all right all right all right we'll catch in more later Yeah, uh-huh. Alright, Robinson coming in to see the crew. <laughs> hey, 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 hey! Whoop, whoop! Turn, 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 turn! And the doggies. Dog porn brought the dogs. <laughs> you that whole coffee? Yeah. Did you take it easy? Yeah. I was going to say that. I nice and easy. that way. One of the other attractions out here at Crimea River. These little cement bridges. Kind of cool. There's a couple of them. But they're always just like convenient. So, all right. I am basically a marathon man, so about a quarter. And wait for it to actually turn. That is 614. So doing good. Feeling good. Got the crew here now. Just waiting on Eileen. But it was great to see Tara and Aaron. I should have turned it on when I first 
So I'm back at the aid station for the first time at the start finish. <laughs> that was funny. Aaron's ready to kick my ass. Tara shaking her head. All in good fun now. We all just want to come out here, succeed, and have a good time. So, all right. Woo, about a quarter of the way in. Let's keep it going. Trying to get it, but there's turkeys up ahead. Already seen a couple deer. There they go, up the ridge. Oh, here we go. Huh. All right. Fun you have out here. We are, let's see. Almost 29 miles in. Having a good time. Jamming out. Little Carl Hayes. Sorry, Hayes Carl. I always fucked his name up. Go down the road today. All right, coming out from Green Valley. I didn't show this last time, but we're hitting the little nooks and cranny trail crossing sessions. These are different because they keep intersecting this road that runs through the parks here. I think. We're in Detweiler by now, if not, we're close. <clears throat> so from South Robinson. So it goes Wakanda, North Robinson, South Robinson, Detweiler. So the next stop will be that sled hill. And then about um, a little over a mile and a half to the turnaround. So, good times. Slow it down nicely. I'm at a lot more comfortable of a pace for what I should be doing. Not that it was uncomfortable earlier. It was just fresh legs and hopes and dreams type shit. But, still doing good. I just dropped a 15 and some change on that last mile. We're just about 50K in. Um, the next mile will be 50K. So, I've got 30 down. So, 30% of the race. Um, trails are good. Rain was quick. Just saw Ben less than a half mile ago. The race leader, he's having himself a good day. Completely expected that out of him. In fact, if anything, he's a tick slow for what I personally was expecting out of him. Uh, just looking at his history. But who knows? I might be wrong. Uh, might be being conservative, which is smart for this course. I know that from witness, unless your name's James Solomon. It was just a badass all around. He'll be good when he gets out here. He's crewing and pacing uh, one of the runners, Eric. Um, but it'd be good to see him out here with his wife. I saw his wife when I was coming back in uh, at the start finish. So, yeah, good times. Definitely good times. Little extended cut of the trail. I mean, this is the whole course. Trails like this. A little bit of gravel on two spots for a, one long downhill. But otherwise, I mean, this is a lot of single track, a lot of fairly well established old trails. So, all right, coming up on my crew, checking it out at Sled Hill. Myself. 
<laughs> My GoPro. All right, we are officially over 33 miles, almost 34. So we're a third of the way through. It's starting to get dark. 100 kers just started. So feeling all right. Slowed it down nicely. And we'll see how this goes. Or trees. All right, just saw my first trash panda of the night. Raccoons are out. Now it's Seymour. Jim Arnold, they're for you. I tell you, it doesn't get creepier than going downstairs in the dark. Welcome to Seymour at night, people. Woohoo! Good job, runner. Likewise, kick Get ass. Up, dude. Likewise. All right. Tunnel at night. All right. Another case coming through. Great work. All right, Seymour at dark, or Seymour after dark. Whoa. Cool shit, cool, cool shit. Yeah. Can't wait to get a pacer. <laughs> All right. Onwards. All right, Aaron, we got Seymour at night. Seymour at night. In the rain. In the rain. With thunder. A little thunder. It's not Thor's Day thunder. You got extra batteries in case you guys? What, this? Yeah. I'll have it. I'll charge it on oh. the way back. Okay. <coughs> But, yeah, loop three. Woo! We're heading up to 50. So, all right. Oh, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> we picked up James, and we're raining. Fuck yeah. See you tomorrow night, baby. Oh, yeah. I'm going to catch my runner. Go get him, James. <laughs> Fucking crazy. A little thunder, a little lightning, a little flooding. Yeah. Standing water everywhere. Well, we are officially back to the land of the sketch. Be careful. Be careful. Okay, yeah. Give None given. <laughs> Can I get one of those Yep. No, grab a pole. Nope, grab a pole. Take one. I got this one. It's my right hand. You want one yet? Yep. You need one? I like this right here. Okay. Hey. Whoop. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why I bothered with this. Alright. It's pretty slow and this is going to take it to a lot of work. Yeah. Yeah, she's the one that uh sucked with him. There's a hole right behind this one. What? A hole. Where? Right here where my pole is. 
Big hole, yes. There you go. Come, use your pole, and feel the stone. You can step on the stone. It's right in front of you. There you go. Thank you. You too. Get you things that pile of water me. Or, uh, be more. Well, the update. It's raining. We're all stopped. Aaron is dying. It being saved by the Blackstone with pizza roll. Um, yeah, they, were, they stopped the race at the moment. So we are just going to sit here and wait until it's safe to run again. Might be a while. Travis, what took you so long? Everything fucking hurts. <laughs> what are you bitching about? Did you think it would tickle? I was hoping are you going tickle. for the 100? No. You going for the 100K? 100K. I uh, guess what? One more huh. link loop. Sir. One more loop. <laughs> one more loop. No, seriously, you got it. No, one more two mile loop. Oh, you got to do a Wakanda? Yeah. All right. Fucking let's go. Your sleeping partner's coming. Yeah! Thank you for that power nap, buddy. I appreciated it. You like your shirt? <laughs> you can't control that. It's fucking terrible for you guys. You can't control that. Two hours, 32 Mother nature. Good job, man. I wish I wouldn't have done that, you know? All right, doing a little recap video from Crimea River 100 mile turned into 100K. Uh, let's see. Um, so as you watch the video, you'll see some things that happened on the third loop. Mother Nature took over uh, and wiped out the 100 milers. So we ended up having um, what basically a seven hour delay. Um, what it turned out to be because of flash flooding thunderstorms everything like that i tried to get the motor going again because we were given three three very nice options uh option one was just dnf and, uh, and they wouldn't register as a dnf uh, or a dns they would just you know wipe the the slate on that and put you in for next year's race for free or you could drop down to the 100k and uh, which is what I ultimately did myself um, and uh, again come back next year try it again uh, if you wanted to continue on and then the third and uh, uh, final option was to continue on uh, with really no chance of finishing uh, unless you were a lot stronger of a, a runner um, so it would have been a sub 30 hour uh, finish no matter what then at that point um, and I was on pace actually for right in the 29 to 30 hour range uh, but when I kicked the motor uh, in the morning to get it going so we we stopped a little after midnight and at 8 a.m. is was the official uh, you can get going again um, I may or may not started a couple minutes early uh, but from Green Valley. So the Green Valley aid station is right after one of the major creek crossings. Um, and that's where I got stopped. Uh, in the whole flash flood, you'll see everything else. Um, but uh, tried to, I wanted to see how it went going through that section again, how the flood waters affected me, how the, the layoff affected me. Uh, I was good for about five miles and then I wasn't good anymore. 
Uh, everything had stiffened up pretty significantly, especially in my hip area. Uh, just kind of felt like you had the screws getting tightened to you. So uh, I knew I couldn't maintain that pace anymore. And uh, so dropped down to the 100K, called it a day, and uh, I'm very much looking forward to next year. Jenna, Sean, and Dave uh, put on a great, great race. And uh, uh, I can't wait to see them all again next year and get this thing done. But uh, it's, a, it's a wonderful race. If anyone has the opportunity to come to Central Illinois and get your ass kicked, the elevation is there to kick anyone's uh, butt. The time of year is hot, humid, and Midwesterny, and uh, it's a very challenging course. Uh, wouldn't have it any other way. Uh, they call you call you crybabies in the uh, email, and they call it Crimea River for a reason. And uh, I enjoy it, and I'll be back next year.